well hello and welcome to another little tutorial video today i thought it would be really fitting to talk about how to build some really cool christmas trees let's get started right away i don't even want to talk too much someone i have looked up to very much when it comes to building for this video specifically building christmas trees is none other than good times of scar himself his latest Christmas tree on Hermitcraft Season 9. It, it, it's just... It's just the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. So I thought we could try to incorporate what Scar does into our own trees a little bit. So let's actually get started. So the first thing I would do is try to get some sort of reference going for the type of tree you want to make. That could be any reference. Get up some pictures of real Christmas trees or Minecraft ones made by other people. If your tree ends up looking very much like a tree made by someone else, then please just credit them. Do what I did. I chose Scar to base this tutorial on because I really like his trees very much. Just get your entire desktop full with trees. Isn't that epic? <laughs> so you got your reference. Time to look at the reference. Again, I will use Scar's trees for this and we're going to learn how to build those. But you could just do the same process with any other tree. Okay, so the first thing I can see with Scar's trees immediately is that it is the curviest and most crooked thing ever. A quote from him. Yeah, I absolutely love our curvy and crooked tree. I think it has some fun and beautiful personality. And whenever I make Minecraft Christmas trees like this, I like to add a little bit of curves, a little personality to it, as an upside down triangle gets rather boring. So I think that looks really, really cool. Oh, I, I do really agree. Whatever tree you are making, you can make it more interesting if you bend it a little bit. Well, don't build a tower of blocks straight up. Make it more like a spiral staircase. Oh wait, that was too much. Wait, what? It actually looks really good. If we get back to analyzing Scar's trees again, there is another thing that he mentions. We've got the star at the top. We have the ornaments and the lights. And as you go down, the ornaments get a little bit bigger. Force perspective is something I heard about from Scar for the first time ever. And I think it makes a lot of sense. Let me explain it in my own words. Things that are further away, things that are further away, look smaller than things that are nearest to us. That is perspective. Force perspective is using that knowledge and tricking the brain into thinking something is closer or further away than it actually is. <clears throat> we can use that later when we build the ornaments on our tree to make it look a little bit taller. Another thing to consider for your tree, do you want to have a lot of leaves or do you want to have very little? That's the second most influential thing on the shape of your tree. We'll get back to that when we get to adding the leaves. So let's add some leaves. That was quick. For the leaves, you can use any leaves. You don't even need to use leaves at all. Let's build some branches to put the leaves onto. Scar to the side. Two, three, organic, both. To build branches, build them out at an angle. The staircase without the spiral. Uh, a little spiral? Ooh, galaxy tree. If we continue with that staircase analogy, how long you make the steps depends on how steep you want the branches to be and how big your tree is. When you build your branches, make sure that you make them a bit thinner on the end. You can also add branches to the branches, but then make them thinner than the original ones. Hooray, your tree is done. Time to add some decorations. This is where, depending on the version you're playing, your decorations might look a bit different. Here are a few design ideas I came up with for beta and modern Minecrafters. Here. Take a look.
this is all I have to say. I really hope you enjoy this little tutorial. I also wanted to say right at the end here, thank you so much for 1000 subscribers. I absolutely cannot believe it. Again, thank, thank you so much. What? I don't know when this video will come out, uh, but I hope it's still early enough. I also hope you will enjoy your Christmas time and that you... I think we forgot about someone. Let's let him do the outro. Scar, you want to do the outro? But until next time, this has been Good Times with Scar and I always really appreciate you guys taking the time to watch the videos. And if you believe the videos are ready, that would be a much appreciated. And until next time, we'll see you later. Don't forget to subscribe because you may just become scarred for life. Hey. Merry Christmas.